Good morning. How are you guys doing today? Uh, if you can see, I'm a little bit shaky, and the reason why is because I actually just got off the phone with the one of the managers at Trader Joe's in Colorado Springs, and um, she seemed really nice. Her name was Annie, um, but the lead wasn't in uh, today. Um, because right now in Trader Joe's we're uh, currently doing reviews, and so um, a lot of the leads or captains are actually uh, uh, gone um, just to write all the reviews and such for all of the crew members. But uh, it was pretty exhilarating. She seemed very nice, so I'm very excited. Um, I just got to get my nerves down. Um, so, but I have an appointment tomorrow at... 8.30. As you can see, I've been taking all of these notes when I was on the phone with her. Um, and, uh, she, yeah, hopefully everything goes well. Hopefully Todd is just as nice as Annie was and just as helpful um, and just as understanding as well. Um, but anyway, yeah, it's going to be a short blog today because I feel like crap. If you haven't noticed with my voice, it <coughs> I actually woke up this morning and, or last night after the hike and uh, felt like crap. I called my mom and I was telling her how I had this crazy migraine um, for like hours, hours. And uh, I actually lay down and I had a cold rag on me the whole time. Uh, and it got so hot and I had to wring it out and redo it three times in one hour. It was insane. I just was burning up. But anyway, I feel... Uh, a lot better today. Um, I still have a little bit of a headache, and I think I am actually coming down with something. Uh, hopefully not throat. Just hopefully I just have a a really stuffed up nose today. <laughs> um, but I do have to work. Uh, but I have tomorrow off, which is nice. So hopefully I can sleep a lot of the day and not uh, video edit and uh, such. Yeah. Uh, anyway. <laughs> So I am excited. I hope everything goes well, and um, like I said before my previous vlogs, I am uh, currently looking to transfer out of San Luis Obispo County, um, and California, and to a new place, uh, Colorado, which I have been there before. <clears throat> Excuse me. I have been there before. I have lived there, um, but not in Colorado Springs. I was in this very uh, uh, dirty little town uh, called Trinidad. I even the, To even say it is just like, oh, I feel like I have to go take a shower now, um, which I, I got to anyways because I haven't yet this morning. Um, don't worry, it's only like 9.30, uh, but uh, <laughs> I uh, shout out to all of you in Trinidad. Um, Hopefully you don't dislike it. Like it. I shout it out to you. Uh, so I'm excited to uh, be in Colorado Springs and trying something new. Um, there are many, many, many amazing little trails and hikes and mountains. And the scenery is beautiful there. And uh, I have currently been looking at a place there and uh for a master bedroom and closet walk-in and my own bathroom uh it is i think like 385 which is dirt cheap considering that i'm paying 400 uh and soon to be paying more uh if i don't transfer uh um for a trailer which i mean i'm sure that a couple of my trailers could fit into the room alone, and then I have the kitchen, and then I have the living room, and then I have, which is common area. Um, by the way, I actually uh, will have a roommate. I think I might have two roommates. The one of them I don't know yet, but the one I've been uh, talking to constantly. Her name is Eve, and she is. Uh, she seems so awesome. Actually, she replies with these long, long texts, uh, which is great, uh, giving me ample, ample, ample description of the place and uh, sending me pictures and such, so I really can't wait to go and check it out. It, it looks like an amazing place, and I definitely will be vlogging it um, for all of you to see. Um, and yeah, so that's going to be my vlog today. Um, 
hopefully I can get some mucinex in me or some emergency or some coles or something so I don't feel like crap all day today um, or I mean at least coffee uh, but yeah I hope all of you have an amazing day and an amazing morning and uh, don't forget to go out and do something uh, especially if you have to work make sure to like take 20 minutes just go walk around the block or something or do something where you feel uh, like you're getting back into nature that you're uh, breathing that fresh air hopefully fresh air I know that some of you live in very heavily heavily industrialized areas and you know the smog is around and such like that and you know pollution and so if you can just go outside and if you can just see nature just look at trees or whatnot then uh, I think that you definitely did more than a lot of other people who have been stuck in an office all day or have been stuck in their car or stuck in a store or whatnot so or even just in their home I mean people just like to stay in their home in our home bodies but at the same time you need to reconnect somehow and unless your uh, home is filled with all of these trees and uh, rivers and lakes and uh, mountains and snow and birds and all these different type of creatures which if so please invite me over but uh, for the most majority of us as you can see I don't have any pets with me um, so or nature oh I actually do have some Let's see. right there I have uh, in that blue bottle on the top they're actually peonies. Oh, I don't know if you can see it, but oh, actually you can't see it. And um, which they're dying. Uh, the other ones uh, at the bottom, which the little bushes. I wish I could. There we go. There. I'll point to it. Right, right there. Those <clears throat> are actually. Uh, um, I think it's a succulent. I don't think it's a succulent. Uh, it's some type of flower. Uh, I think it's like an anthonym or something. And. I had it since Valentine's Day, but I haven't watered it in a couple of days. Um, but it just is gradually dying faster and faster, so I don't know what to do with it. I think it might be root bound, but I don't know. And I guess the only thing that is uh, animal like, other than, you know, me, is my little bear, which is also my necklace holder. Uh, he's so happy. He's always happy to see me, which is so awesome. Uh, Hello, uh, actually, update, uh, this is the next day, um, it is 8.47 in the morning, so excuse the absolute bed head and the dirty mess behind me, um, so I actually just got off the phone, um, uh, with the lead over there, and he, in Colorado Springs, um, and if you've already forgotten, already almost halfway through the video, that um, I actually am wanting to transfer to Colorado and uh, at the Trader Joe's over there, um, but it looks like they have no, absolutely no openings. They're completely packed. They have the student program that they have in the summertime, and so they just hired, I think he said six or seven students, um, and he said that he they probably won't be accepting anything or anyone uh, for the next three to five months so that throws my projection out of the water of August um, which I guess is a bittersweet thing for me because now I can go to my grandmother's uh, I actually don't know how old she is but she's very old up there in age and um, she is having a birthday uh, surprise birthday party in Vegas this summer and because of the whole transfer thing and everything, I, I wasn't able to, or I was going, and then the whole transfer thing came to mind, and I told myself, well, you know, you have to save money and this and that to actually relocate, because cha relocating states is uh, such a huge, huge, huge uh, expense, and so I told myself that I wasn't going to be able to go, and it was a week long in Vegas, um, but now it looks like I... I am able to do it. So I'm excited. I'm going to be going to Vegas in uh, July, July, August. Um, and yeah, I mean, it's a bittersweet thing. Uh, hopefully, I will, you know, I'm still going to manifest that it is still working and that it's, it's still going to uh, be processed and go through that um, it will just be 
think he said October, November. Uh, he has me on the list, so stay tuned. But I guess until then, California doesn't want to get rid of me yet. <laughs> so, but anyway, um, I hope you all have a wonderful day. Love you. Bye.